Werner Fassbender isn't well known to most moviegoers yet, but in film circles he's been a creative phenomenon for the last 10 years. In more than 35 films, he's examined the German state of mind in the years after the war. His characters are usually very practically obsessed with the things that are nearest to them, like age, money, jobs, aging, and death. And those are the subjects of Fassbender's first real box office success, The Marriage of Maria Braun. Hannah Shagula plays the heroine, a young woman who marries a soldier in the closing days of World War II, and then, after her husband disappears, barters and prostitutes her way up from utter destitution to become a sophisticated and even ruthless businesswoman. We are getting tired of this. Was hat er gesagt? Er hat das bisherige Ergebnis zusammengefasst. Ich habe irgendwas gehört, dass er müde ist. Das hat er auch gesagt, dass er satt hat. Also, was machen wir? Sieht aus, als hätten wir uns da doch etwas übernommen. Vielleicht ist das Geschäft wirklich etwas zu groß für uns. Da müssen wir auf Nylon verzichten und die deutsche Frau weiterhin das Gewebte... Darf ich auch mal was sagen? Ja, natürlich. Sie gehen jetzt in Ihre Küche und trinken Cognac und geben mir eine halbe Stunde Zeit hier. Das ist nicht mehr seriös, wenn ich das bemerken darf. Frau Braun, das hat mit Übersetzungsfragen nichts mehr zu tun. Bitte Senkenberg. Herr Senkenberg hat schon recht, ich verstehe nichts vom Geschäft, aber ich verstehe was von der deutschen Frau, von Nylon und Gewebten. Ich verstehe überhaupt sehr viel von der Zukunft, da bin ich sozusagen Spezialist. Und außerdem, wenn die Sache nun sowieso schon geplatzt ist, dann kann es ja auch weiter nicht schaden. Sie können doch immer noch Nein sagen am Ende. Es ist immerhin die erste lustige Idee an diesem ganzen verfahrenen Tag. Bei allem Respekt, Herr Oswald. Frau Braun hat doch wirklich keine Erfahrung auf unserem Gebiet. Dann macht sie eben jetzt welche. You can tell by the look in her eye there, she's a real survivor. Mm -hmm. Maria Braun has to move carefully in the cutthroat world of German businessmen. She uses her knowledge of men and her own sexuality to move to the top of a big textile corporation. The marriage of Maria Braun uses its central character to reflect the story of many Europeans in the decade after World War II. And Hannah Shigola's performance as Maria is one of the year's most interesting. I know everyone's saying that they like her performance so much. Uh, I can think of a number of actresses, I think, who could have played the role. What I'm impressed with here is the totality of the picture. You know, there are lots of movies where there's one great performance or a great gimmick or a very mm -hmm. topical mm -hmm. story. They got the right issue at the right time. Here's a film where the whole world has been recreated. Germany right after the war with people scurrying around trying to survive get to the top, other people just trying to live if they can. Right, yeah. And he's got the whole world there. I'm always amazed when a film up on the screen can create a whole world where I feel like I've been right there. And what's neat about this is that he creates two worlds in a way. One world is the realistic world of that period after World War II. The yes. other world is the Fassbender world. Because he likes to put a little edge on things. People are just a little bit mannered. You could see that in the scene that we just saw. The uh, decor is just a little bit too much. The colors are just a little bit off, just so you can't really put your finger on it. But there's sort of an attitude toward it. So he does that, yeah. and he also does the other thing, it's too. It's reality heightened and made dramatic. Right. Uh, I, I, when I saw this picture, I thought, you know, there are a lot of people who lived right after World War II in Germany mm -hmm. and other countries who are going to say, you know, I knew characters like that. And that's how they got to the top. They're, you know, they say there's a line about every great fortune is built on a crime. Well, this woman's fortune that she builds is built on a crime. And, and you get the feeling here that we're seeing a real story that could have happened, a great saga, a very entertaining picture. I very know it's in good Ger film, yes. It's in German, mm -hmm. some people have a great uh, avoidance of uh, subtitled pictures. This one is easy to understand and very enjoyable. I agree. We agree on the marriage of Maria Braun, the post-World War II German film about an indomitable woman. We both give Maria Braun an enthusiastic yes.